So I wanted to give a quick update on my sort of Forceman Sherwood Forest, I guess I would call it. <laughs> um, I have been slowly chipping away at some new rock work. This is my first time doing it, and um, I've been collecting gray bricks. Some of them are different colors. You know, not everything is the same old gray color, which I love, but that's okay. It's kind of from far away, it has a pretty cool effect. Um, I really like that. Um, from far away, it has a really great effect. I love it. And um, this is the kind of a short cliff hill for my Forestman hideout. Above, above kind of a little stream out of the, uh, out of the Forestman's Crossing that travels into a lake. There's the river fortress as well, kind of a swampy area, is kind of the way I imagine it. Under the bridge and then into, into a big lake where you've got some other things happening. Um, but this is the rock work, kind of a cliff that I've been working on. Over on this side, you've got a uh, just a bunch of uh, lerps and burps and different, I tried to make as many different pieces as possible, not all the same to look like a wall. Um, sort of got a little ledge here, you can put a forest guy. Not sure about that arch, you can let me know what you think in the comments. Or maybe I can try to build it into the rock more. And it kind of uh, has some trees covering it up and a little bit of green down there to simulate like some moss or whatever. And but the little gray parrot, which I imagine it just being like a hawk or something on the rock and kind of this corner there. It's not perfect, but it's again, this is my first time. We have to redo some work there. Not sure what happened, but I'll get back to it and make it better as time goes on. And then there's actually my little eight year old's idea to have kind of a little waterfall thing happening coming out of the rock there. I thought that was pretty cool using the pieces that we have. Kind of is almost like a little spigot. And then some of the, uh, not a spigot, but like a small tiny waterfall going down. And then some of it's coming out of the rock. I know it looks a little bit Minecrafty or whatever, but I like it from far away and I like to just kind of use as many of the bricks I have. It sort of is a little tiny stream coming into the larger sort of stream. And then I've got sort of a mini forest here. Not a whole lot happening. Down below, let's see if I can get over here. I kind of had this almost like a cavernous outcrop. I like the way that turned out. There's like a big hole. And some of that was on purpose, some of it not. Um, but it, I thought it looked pretty cool. And then you kind of got this ladder thing happening over here that they can pull up and get to the get to the hideout which I thought was pretty cool and it kind of is hidden as you come over this way or as kind of the directions that the enemies would come into the forest and up to the creek it's kind of hidden from side view which I thought was pretty cool but let me know what you guys think um, I thought it turned out pretty well I really like it, um, especially from far away, like this angle looks great. I definitely want some more on the top for sure, but it takes a long time to collect enough bricks to do something <laughs> of that scale. But thanks for tuning in and hit a like and subscribe and uh, share the video if you dig it. But I'm sure having a lot of fun putting these things together and collecting my old vintage favorites.